Hello and welcome back to my channel and welcome if you are new. Today I have a rather large grocery haul for you. I did go to Costco, I went to Kroger, and I went to Sprouts. Now the Sprouts items I did do through Instacart, but then I ended up having to run inside because I, because I had forgotten a few items um, in my Instacart order. I did have a couple of coupons to use, so I want to go ahead and use those up today. However, I did place um, an order with um, through Instacart with Aldi because I needed some ground beef. However, that did not work out. <laughs> that did not work out. They ended up rescheduling my order for tomorrow, which, um, is not going to work for me to go and pick that up. So I'm just going to have to go inside, um, later on this week or next week or whatever, and pick up what I need at that time. But I do have a little bit of ground beef to, um, definitely get us through until I can do that. And I'll show you some other things that I actually picked up too, that that's going to help fill in the gap of the ground beef that I was hoping to have. But let me go ahead and show you guys what I picked up so this video is not super long. All right, I picked up some organic baby spinach. This is Costco first. Uh, best price for a pound of spinach. And then I picked up a pound of organic spring mix. The best price for that as well. I picked up three packages of these organic Wagyu 100% grass-fed burgers. We missed having these in the house. I picked up some of this organic uh, raw sauerkraut for my husband. I picked up a big jar of these pickles because we like to have these in the house during grilling season. I saw this big old jug of mango nectar and I thought I would get this for my daughter because she's really been enjoying making popsicles for her and my son. So I um, figured she could use that and mix it with some other things and make some delicious treats for them. Um, I picked up some organic coconut water. This is going to be for smoothies. I also like to drink this after a workout um, just to get some electrolytes back in. I picked up some of these Beatality Beats. These are for my husband mainly, but my son likes them as well. I got some organic steel cut oats and these were uh, better priced than the ones on Azure. So I had to go ahead and grab those. That's a five pound bag guys for $6.97. All right, I picked up some of these organic coconut rolls. I got two bags of these because these were on sale. And yeah, we really like to have these for a snack. I picked up some chumps meat sticks for my husband to take to work. Back here, you guys can see, I got two big old bags of these organic whole green beans. Oh my goodness, guys, it has been months since I've been able to get these and my Costco. So when I saw them fully stocked, I went ahead and got two bags because I just, I'm hoping these last us for a while and that when I do need to go back and get them, they will have them in stock. All right, I think that is everything that I got from Costco guys, except the 40 count pack of water. All right, let me show you guys what I got from Kroger. All right, I picked up some of this Pacific chicken broth just because I needed some chicken broth. I got two of those. Picked up another organic beef bone broth just to have in the pantry. I picked up five bags of this Nature's Own um, Everything Hamburger Buns. I got five of these. And the reason I got five is because I had a really good deal on these. Guys, these were on sale for $3.49. And I believe if you buy five, save five. I don't I think they were $3.49 with a buy five, save five. I think that's it. Anyway, I had a Kroger cashback offer to where um, I'll get back five dollars. I get back a um, dollar on each one of these, so it's five dollars total. Plus, these counted towards my Ibotta bonus because I had a dollar off on each one of these through Ibotta. That's an amazing deal. Made these about a dollar and forty-nine cents each, and we will definitely go through these buns with all the burgers that I just purchased. All right, I picked up some organic bananas. I've really, really, really been preferring to buy my bananas at Kroger lately because Kroger just has some really good quality bananas. All right, I picked up three bags of these, my favorite tortilla chips. These were on sale for $3.99. I picked up some of this Vital Farms sea salted butter. Uh, this was another one of my 
deals through Ibotta. I got 50 cents back for buying each one of these. And, and I'm gonna scan my receipt through Maryfield and I'm gonna get some points back for purchasing these there. I picked up this milk, it was on clearance. And honestly guys, I just got this to cook with. We're not gonna drink this uh, for cereal. You know, We're not gonna put this on cereal or drink this or anything like that. This is strictly for uh, just cooking with. And this was on clearance for $3.59. As you can see, the date is I think June 6th on it. So it doesn't have um, too much longer before it expires, but this will be gone by then because I'm gonna use this for baking. And this was $3.59 and then I did get back $2.39 through Ibotta for purchasing this, making this about $1.20. All right, I picked up, what else did I get from? Kroger. I think that's all I got from Kroger. I think that's everything. All right, now I'm going to show you guys what I got from Aldi. All right, I picked up three of these pure black cherry, these Lakewood pure black cherry juices. I almost didn't get these. If I hadn't gone in the store, I would not have these because I tried to order these through the app and the app said that they were not in stock. But when I went inside of the store, these were fully stocked. So I went ahead and got three of them because uh, my daughter and I like to have this uh, every month. And my husband has been enjoying this with some sparkling water um, when he gets home from work. All right, I picked up some of this uh, Bulgarian buttermilk. I just used this to cook with. I was buying kefir, but honestly guys, I feel like that's kind of, kind of a waste. I don't know why it took me so long to realize that, but uh, kefir, that organic raw kefir is really meant to be um, drank raw so that you can get all the benefits from it uh so i probably won't be buying that and cooking with it if i do purchase that we'll just drink that or, or put it in smoothies but if i'm going to just use buttermilk uh for if i need buttermilk for baking i'm just going to probably buy this because this is really really good buttermilk and yeah i am trying to cut costs and this is uh way more cost effective than buying the kefir to cook with all right, I picked up two of these organic taco shells. We're gonna have some tacos this week. I got those from Sprouts. I picked up two of these organic barbecue sauces. Probably gonna have that on some chicken this week. I picked up two of these mixy black cherry and lime uh, sparkling waters. I did order some through Azure, so I hope those come as well because I do like to have these stocked up pretty uh, well during the cold months because this is what we drink in place of soda we don't drink soda or anything like that and we really try to not have sugary drinks um, to sort of quench our thirst uh, when we're doing things outside in the summer so these come in handy so I like to have these on stock um, you drink them over ice or so just put them in the refrigerator and get them cold uh, but those are actually on sale this week as well all right I picked up two bags of these um, avocado oil these Boulder Canyon avocado oil chips. I really like the thin and crispy ones are the best, but these are really, really good too. I mean, pretty much the same ingredients, except these are, um, these are just, uh, these have ridges. Okay, I picked up some organic, try not to rustle the bag too much, but picked up some organic Roma tomatoes. Mine and the garden are not ready yet. So I had to buy tomatoes. I picked up three packages of our favorite hot dogs these are so good guys these are the best hot dogs ever but because there was a sale on these and these were actually included in that coupon that i had on my account i decided to go ahead and grab two of these as well it was these and the and the potato chips um that counted toward the ten dollar coupon that i had on my account so I did get two of these and then these were 25% uh, off when you bought two of them. Plus I had that $10 off coupon. I don't remember how these taste. I hadn't tried these. It's been um, quite a while since I've had these, but the ingredients are really clean. These are shorter, fatter hot dogs. Unlike the thinner, longer, unlike the thinner, longer ones that we're used to with the Teton, but clean ingredients. So I think we'll enjoy those. Hopefully the kids will enjoy those uh, with the buns. I'm about to show you guys in just a second. All right, I picked up this two pound pack of 100% grass fed ground beef. Um, this was actually included in that deal as well in the, um, the $10, I think this was included in that $10 off uh, coupon deal. Yes, I believe this was included as well. So I did pick this up. This was not the best deal, but this was on sale. And with the $10 off, 
um, it did make this quite a bit more affordable. And this used to be my favorite uh, ground beef to purchase when I first started buying grass-fed um, healthier ground beef. I used to get it at Sprouts all the time um, until I found the organic grass-fed ground beef at Aldi. So anyway, I did pick that up. So that'll kind of carry us. That'll be some ground beef that we can have to put in some recipes. All right, I picked up a five pound bag of potatoes. I did order some potatoes through Azure, but um, today is the cutoff for Azure. And so I won't get that order until next week. So I just wanted some potatoes in the house so that we can have some sides to go with all these burgers and um, dogs and sausages and things that we, um, that we have in the house. All right, I picked up these coconut bites. You guys, uh, I don't know if you remember, I did buy this brand of coconut bites from, um, from Costco last month, but they weren't this flavor. They were just the coconut and cacao nibs. These actually have cranberries, chia seeds, uh, goji berries, and chocolate. So I'm super excited to try these. This is a much smaller bag, but they were on sale for $3.99. And honestly, this is more than enough. I really don't wanna have a huge bag of this stuff sitting around the house because my husband and I are trying to get in shape. We're trying to get healthy. And this is just like a nice little treat to have every now and then, but I don't wanna have like a big stock of just snacks like this uh, in the house. Okay, I picked up some of my organic lemon juice. This is just for me to have lemon water in the morning. I picked up two of these A2 grass, uh, grass fed whole milks. This milk is not as good, not nearly as good as the milk that I get from Azure. But until I can get that order in and hopefully that milk ships, this is what I have purchased for us to um, drink if the kids want cereal or something like that. Now I'm going to show you everything that I picked up from Walmart. All right, the first thing I got was this little bitty teeny travel size Colgate Max Fresh. Now I don't know, we'll probably just put this in our little bin in the closet and somebody will use it. But this was 97 cents and I got a $2 rebate back through Ibotta for purchasing this. I also picked up this. I've really been loving having these in the kids' bathroom. This is a new scent. It's called Georgia Peach Orchard. And this was $3.24 and I got back $2.30. I picked up some of these hamburger buns. Didn't have a deal on these, but Walmart is the best price to buy these. There were three on the shelf, guys, and I did get the three because I have had the hardest time lately finding these in stock. And these are really the only buns that we prefer to eat with our hot dogs. So I did get three of those. We'll put uh, two in the freezer and keep one of them out. All right, I picked up some of this organic pie filling. Oh my goodness. So these were $3.48 and I got back a dollar on each one of them through Ibotta. And each one of these um, cans counted towards um, one of the offers from a bonus. Um, the ingredients in here are really, really, really clean. So I was shocked that these were actually included in the offer. But if that offer reloads to my account, I'm probably going to go back and get some more of these. I've already purchased five before and the offer reloaded. And so I went back and I got these. But that's a really good offer. We'll put those in the pantry. And if I want to make a quick pie, we'll just pull those out. All right, I picked up some apples. My husband likes to take these to work. We do have some in the refrigerator, but since he's been taking so many of them to work every single day, I wanted to make sure that we had a good stock of apples. All right, I picked up these toasted. I picked up these toasted crackers, and these do not have the best ingredients, guys. I'm not sure. We may eat these, but this is something that we don't eat all the time but anyway these toasteds were completely free plus a little bit of a money maker like a, a little bit of, like a dollar and something money maker i believe these were three dollars and 48 cents and i got back five dollars for buying these so i was uh happy to purchase those i picked up the i picked up this all free and clear detergent i did get back 625 kicks from shopkick as well as a dollar and fifty cents through Ibotta for purchasing this. So I think, guys, I'll put the math on the screen for you, but I think it made this about 90 something cents, which is a really good deal for laundry detergent. So I picked up some toilet paper. Guys, I went back and forth trying to decide where I want to get toilet paper. I ha we have our favorites, whatever, but I will say my favorite toilet paper that we bought last time has really disappointed me, has really disappointed all of us. Um, I really like the Quilted Northern, and I've been finding deals on that through um, Kroger, and I even found a really good deal on it through um, Amazon. 
and I bought a huge package of it. And I don't know, it's just not strong toilet paper. It used to be so much better, but it just crumbles. It just kind of breaks in your hand when you just use it for the smallest of tasks. So I don't know, I'm probably gonna, we're gonna try this out, uh, go back to this one and see how we like it. Um, but in the meantime, um, I'll probably be trying to figure out where is going to be the best place to get toilet paper. If you guys have any suggestions, please put them in the comments below. I would really appreciate that. All right. I picked up two of these cans of Rotel. I just really like to have these in my pantry and I've been using them. So it's good to replenish two of those. These counted towards my Ibotta bonus as well. Not both of them, but just uh, not each one of them, but both of them together counted as one. All right, I picked up five cans of these Taco Fiesta beans, and each one of these did count towards my bonus. We love these beans. These are so, so delicious, and they're not that expensive, so I did go ahead and get five of those. All right, guys, and the very last thing that I picked up are two bags of these uh, non-GMO sweet potatoes from Walmart. These are so good. They're almost, they're always really, really good every time I purchase them. And they're um, way cheaper than the organic sweet potatoes. I usually, um, I had been buying those whenever I would find them in the store. And I did see them in this Walmart today, but they were like double the price of these. So I decided to go ahead and grab these just so we could have some healthy sweet potatoes and not break the bank. Okay guys, that is everything that I picked up today for groceries. If you guys have any questions or comments, please put them in the box below. And I will talk to you guys in my next video.